Right now, Florida is on track to break its record for Panther road kills. Another Panther was struck and killed on Treeline Boulevard earlier this week, bringing the total number of Panther deaths to 17 so far this year. But why such a big increase in Panther deaths? We sent four in your corner Sarah Bell Soul to find out, and the answer we're finding is bittersweet. Needing ample roaming space and certain types of prey, the Florida Panther has made Southwest Florida its home. Collier County really is the uh, the stronghold for that population now. But living so close to roads has proven deadly for the population. 14 of the 17 confirmed Panther deaths this year have been blamed on vehicle strikes. A number on track to break the record for number of deaths in a year. Kevin Godsey is a refuge manager for the Florida Panther National Wildlife Refuge. He says while that number seems high, there's more to it. A bit of a double-edged sword. It's kind of sad on one point, but it's also, if you look at it a little bit deeper, uh, the population is increasing and we're, that's, that's important. Biologists estimate there's between 100 and 160 panthers living mostly south of the Caloosahatchee River, a huge increase from 20 years ago when the number declined to about 30. They credit that increase to a genetic restoration project. Where we brought eight female Texas cougars that are their closest relative to the Florida panther uh, in. Uh, when they gave birth to 20 uh, kittens, we pulled those eight uh, females out of the wild. So um, that really boosts the population. Now that population is expanding into areas like Golden Gate Estates and even north of the Glusahatchee. But that also means there's more cats crossing the roads. There's also more people on roads, and this time of year especially, once we get into the winter season, we sit, tend to see more, uh, more road mortalities. So to keep yourself and the Panthers safe, Godsey says it's extremely important to follow the 45 miles per hour speed limit in Panther zones. Sarah Bell Soul Fox 4 in your corner. For more information on how you can help fund Panther research in Southwest Florida, just head to our website, fox4now.com.